Alright, so I wanted to record, uh, I guess a part two to this, because uh, recently one thing has come to light, I thought that if I could, I guess like hide it in a way, um, and move on from it, that it wouldn't be brought up again. So basically, I... Uh, and there's like, there's another thing as well. I want to like, there's one part that I deliberately didn't say in the previous video, and there's one that I actually just forgot about. Um, so, yeah, this is about um, my cheating past, obviously. With uh, the one that I forgot about, uh, it was the Apex. I have a ban on Apex. Um, now, there's two things, uh, two reasons that could be behind it. And I'll give my reasonings as to why I think it's those things. Um, so, I didn't cheat in Apex. Uh, but I did get banned for it. Now, there's something in the rules that dictates that if you queue with someone that's cheating, you will be banned as if you were cheating yourself. Because they don't want people to get around the system. That is one possibility. That is one possibility of how I got banned. Um, because... One of my friends who I queued with every day got banned before me, and then I checked the next day, and I was banned. Uh, because he was the first one banned, I just assumed that he was... Because he got banned, I got banned with him. Um, that That's a possibility. Now, there's also another possibility. I think that one's probably the most true. But there's also another possibility, where I was manually reviewed and banned after that as well. And falsely, by the way, because I've been manually reviewed. And banned falsely quite a few times now. So, though, there's that. There's On Apex, there's that. Um, I'm planning to play some more Apex soon. Because I actually really like that game. Uh, and then there's the second one. Where I deliberately hit it. Because I thought... I made a mistake. Um, I knew I made the mistake. That's why I privated, privated the three videos of it. with Before anyone really found out. Um, I think there was one person that found out. And he only found one video of it, right? Um, I knew there was three videos of me walling in the videos. I consequently privated the first video that he uh, pointed out. And I was like, okay, I privated that one. I don't need to private the other two. Even though I know that they're not legitimate, I don't need to private them because there was no proof in those two videos. Um, but... I decided to private them anyway, um, cause I wasn't lying in my last video. Every video that's on my YouTube at the moment is legitimate and I want to keep it that way. Um, as much as like I have a past, etc. um, and obviously there's reasons behind why I did that sort of stuff. And I, I can go into them now. Um, but yeah, even though I had reasons behind it and stuff like that, they're not good reasons, but they were reasons. Um, and I could have gotten away with the other two videos. I thought that it would be better on my conscience to just private the videos, move on and pretend like it didn't happen because it was just a blip. Ah, uh, because, like, three, three of my videos in my entire catalog that were on my YouTube were in illegitimate, and I didn't think that painted a good, uh, good picture or a correct picture of me. So I privated those three videos uh, like two months ago before anyone knew about it. It's recently come to light. Um, Again, and I deliberately didn't say anything because I thought if I didn't say anything, I made this mistake. I I owned up to it to myself, right? I didn't own up to it to I owned up to it like for other people, but I owned up to it to myself. And I thought, all right, if no one knows about it, I'm just going to have to deal with this by myself. I'll just have to move on and pretend like it didn't happen and um try my best to not make the same mistake again because it happens like. Once every year, uh, like two years, or once every like year and a half, I like buy something for like three three days, and then I may, um do shit. Now, the reason behind, I guess, if you want to know the reasoning behind it, I uh, I was getting down on the fact that 
I was getting so much support and I wanted to upload videos and I tried to get a gameplay for like three to four days, like a nuke for like three to four days. And I just couldn't, I like, I just couldn't hit anything. Uh, I would always get on like 24 kill streaks and then die and then get mad and then like doubt myself. Cause like I'm a pretty, uh, <laughs> I'm a pretty insecure person. So despite like, I'm pretty sure a lot of people will watch this and be like, Oh, of course you're good. Cause I've heard that from people that are like, dude, it, like clearly you're good without it and stuff like that. And I take, I'm, I'm very humbled by, by it because I don't know, I'm not that type of person to, um, genuinely feel like I deserve that validation. Um, but like clearly I, I just get really down on myself. So I, did, I like slumped for like, a, uh, three to three days to like a week. And then I, just, I just thought that I would never get back to my original spot. I saw my stats going down. Like they were like, it was like a, I think I had like a four, four point something KD. And like, I saw it going down. My score per minute was going down from 700 and it already went down to like 700 to 630. So I just assumed that I was getting shit. Um, and I didn't want to disappoint in a way. So I bought it for three days. I played for three days with it. I made the videos, I uploaded them. And then within a day or two, and this was uh, around June, like the start of June, uh, like within a day or two, I privated those videos and I just thought, all right, uh, it's past me. I, I did the right thing. I privated the videos. Maybe the more right thing would have been to tol tell everyone, but which actually is true. I should have told in the original video. It's in the description of that video, by the way. Um, so, but like saying in a public video forum is probably better. And, uh, I, you, I understand that people don't believe that my games are legitimate, um, because of like how bad my past is. Um, but they are, my videos on my YouTube channel are, and I understand if you want to subscribe, unsubscribe, I understand if you don't want to support me anymore because I've made this mistake way too many times. Um, but I am trying to get better. Like, I feel like it has helped me when I have, like, fans like Requiem, Bailey, all of this, that watch me, and they're like, um, even if they don't believe my, my, what, everything I'm saying, like, um, I'm pretty sure Bailey believes I cheated in a tiny bit, a few more stuff. I don't mind that, because I can, can understand it from his perspective, right? But, um, despite that, he's, he was like, he gave me like a pep talk and I think it actually helped me because it like quenched my actual original problem that I had, which is like, oh, I'm not good enough, um, to get these clips like every single, every like day or every three days, which by the way, I upload every day, but like I, those videos are from like four months ago. Most of those nukes are from like four months ago. Um, but like I... Whenever I slump, I just doubt myself. I'm like, maybe I'm not as good as I think, or maybe I'm not as good as what everyone says, um, and all of that type of stuff. And that short of shit makes me do dumb, impulsive shit. And I'm trying to work on that. And I think, like, genuinely from, like, the support of uh, my uh, some of my fans, like Bites, Twisty, Requiem, Bailey, all of that, they're like, dude, even if I do believe that you're cheating in more of your videos, you're clearly entertaining as fuck without your cheats. So, like why do you cheat and stuff like that um and same with like oil mexican he like watched some of it he watched my world record videos um and like i spoke to him like dude i like i was like why did i ever cheat for like those three days it was such a dumb decision and this was before um anything came to light and then like i told him about it and then he's just like he just like agreed and now that i know the issue now i think now that i have i feel like the right support around this um i feel like i like that sort of thing won't repeat again because I won't feel like I'm too isolated from the issue, if that makes sense. Anyway, that's what I wanted to clear up. It's a part two. Um, and I, I understand any consequence that comes from this, but I'm going to continue to upload videos. I'm going to continue to play legitimate and I'm going to try and win back your trust. I'm going to post some monitor cam clips in some of my videos. I'm going to play with a monitor cam, etc. I might take a few days break from the game. 
Um, not from editing. I'll still upload, but I might take a few days break from the game and see what see how it goes from there. Anyway, bye, dudes. Thank you for listening. Goodbye.